Well, I got fired and I'm out of money. So there's this cool thing called NFTs going on. I'm planning to sell photos of papaya. Man, you're so cute papaya. You're gonna net me millions of dollars. But first, I gotta figure out how NFTs work. Boy, am I hungry. Yeah, that felt so good. Let's see what I got here. Quite the option. Samyang Ramen. I'll save this for later. Time to get some cash to buy some food. Money, 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 money. Nani? Ah, oh, shit, I'm actually really broke. What the? What's this? Call for funding? Probably some scam. It's probably a scam, man. It's gotta be a scam. Hello, who's calling? Hello? Do you wish to participate in the game? If you wish to participate, please state your name. Vincent. Later that night. Wake him up. Ah. Do you wish to participate in the Squid Game? If you win all of the games, we will give you ten million dollars. What will happen if I lose? Death. Well, I got nothing else to lose. Yes. I accept your challenge. Perfect. Set up the game. Please look into the camera. Smile. Welcome to the first game. Today we will be playing Red Light, Green Light. But with a small twist. Here is a simple puzzle. Given a grid of size M by N. Each cell will either have a circle or a triangle. A triangle represents land and a circle represents water. Your task is to find the total number of islands on the grid. Here is a simple example. An island is classified as any land that is surrounded by water. You may assume all four edges of the grid are all surrounded by water. Adjacent land horizontally or vertically are considered the same island. In this example, we have a total of three islands. You may go in any language you wish. That's easy. I'll do this with Python. Good choice, but on one condition. There will be music playing in the background. When the music stops playing, you must stop typing as well. If you don't stop, you will be eliminated. Good luck. You have 30 minutes. Alright, what should I do first? I'll start by copying the example. Whoa, almost pressed the key. Alright, let's take this slow and steady. Next, I'm going to write some basic loops to print out each cell. Perfect, no bugs. Hmm, now how do I know if it's an island? If I run away and hide, they will definitely look for me. They will check their vision up, left, right, and down. 
Aha! I got it! All I need to do is some recursion. I need to stop when I see a circle. Hence, that should be the base case. Now we just call the recursion up, left, right, and down. What the? I thought Stack Overflow was supposed to help me. What is wrong with my code? Am I going to die? Alright, maybe a quick nap will help. Oh hi, papaya. The water station? The special umbrella meal? Wait, you ate everything but the umbrella. Was that a dream? What was Papaya trying to tell me? Hurry up, you only have three minutes left. Marked. Marked. What is marked? So my code starts at the top of the grid. The recursion will start, but it will end because the adjacent cells are all circles. This will count as the first island. Next, it will traverse to the next triangle. Now it will do the recursive step again. Since there is another triangle, it will recurse again. Wait a minute, it looks like we've already visited that cell already. Oh, so that's what Papaya meant. I need to mark where I visited. Alright, let's finish this quick. Congratulations, you saved me a bullet. Give him his meal. Thank you for watching. Smash that like button and leave me a comment. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more content. This is only the first challenge. Don't get ahead of yourself. <laughs>